guys, Grungerlam Zero Gaming back here, and in today's video, uh, another long one today, but you know, worth it. So today, we're going to be talking about what will the Halo Infinite ring be like, and what Halo Infinite in Halo Infinite will we be playing on? I know that sounded weird. What Halo Infinite? Yeah, what where will it take place, and which Halo ring will it take place on? So, uh, very good, you know, questions from people. Um, <clears throat> Lore doesn't actually say what it is, so today we're actually going to just like start off from what we saw like in the trailer and kind of like show you like what they're going to be going back to. They're kind of trying to go back to like the old Halo 1 ring, and I'll be showing you guys why uh, in a second. I'll be explaining that. I'll also be going over what it looks like from space and a few other like uh, tricks and the map that they show us to show us exactly which one it will go in, it's is going to be. So guys, that is it. Buckle up and uh, yeah. Basically, here we go. So, uh, pretty much what's going to happen is I put in old graphics. So, this is kind of like the nice uh, moonlight of it. And, uh, yeah, always wear your seatbelt, apparently. But, yeah, this is pretty much it. It has the green grass, and that was actually what they were going for. So, they have in the trailer green grass, the beacon things, you know. I forget what they're called. And, yeah, they shoot out the beacon into outer space, you know, up towards the ring. And which is actually pretty cool, and they do have those now. And they advertised on the trailer that we'll be on a Halo ring, no doubt trying to stop a uh, a threat or find some kind of Forerunner artifact, or maybe they're there to uh, save somebody. As usual, it's kind of like it's kind of cliche now. I mean, unless they want to add something new in, but Halo lore, it's kind of already been like staked out. Like what is going on? So I actually li like to point out a few things. Uh, first of all, in the video, just to, like single out how many rings there are. Uh, there's six to seven rings, judging on like what you count, because there's already like a ring pre-made in the arc, ready to go. So I guess whatever you think, and that is installation zero zero. Uh, installation, well as we know, you know, uh, guilty spark. Installation of zero four. That ring was destroyed by Master Chief. It could have been replaced by the Ark. And then there was the new installation 04 that uh, came out of the Ark, which they blew up. There's also the Ark. I know, it's just like, it keeps it keeps even getting better. There's also the Ark <coughs> on a Halo Wars, which we think that we're going to be fighting the Banished, because that Halo ring went up. So we've kind of like, in Halo lore, you kind of like, they kind of miss, they like, they haven't counted how many, you know, Halo Rings, they kind of lost track of how many Halo Rings there really are. And that's, I guess, just the point I'm trying to make here is, we don't know, but there's a map I'll be showing you guys in a few minutes about what, like, what it, the Halo universe is supposed to look like marked out by Bungie. Now, 343 really hasn't done much with that. They really don't have much lore. And again, you know, the most evilest villain died in a comic, so I mean, what do you expect out of 343 at this point? Uh, probably not to be, you know, exact with where the rings are supposed to be. And then moving back to, like, what rings got destroyed, there was also the ring, which I'll be showcasing again in a minute, with 343. So 343, they created a ring, they created, uh, Insulation 3 where the Forerunner artifact was, and then immediately wiped out all life force on that ring, apparently, just apparently, because, you know, when, spoiler alert, when Halo 4, when the Didact, you know, casts his weird, you know, shield, killing the humans and the humans on Earth, uh, I mean, it might have killed the animals, I'm not sure, but if it did, that means, or, you know, the type of animals, that means that insulation, Zero three has is nothing more than a rocky wasteland at this point, because as we know, you know without life on the Halo ring, it's nothing. You know how that kind of is. And in the trailer, of course, they did show there'd be uh, Earth-like animals in Halo Infinite. So that's pretty much it. So that's why I'm disproving that. So it can either be Installation one, Maybe two, in that mm, Check it out. Uh, five. <laughs> or six. Now, it does depend. Like, like I said, they've lost track of how many really 
halo rings there really are. So you just have to really judge for yourself, I guess. Which, and we'll know for sure when the game comes out or when the trailers are. But pretty much at this point, there is nothing to reveal which halo ring, even though it's halo infinite. So which, I don't know, it hasn't shown there being, you know, like, it hasn't shown the enemies yet. So if it shows you know, the Banish, then we'll know, oh yeah, that's the uh, installation launched from Halo Wars. It'll be easy like that, we'll know exactly which ring it's on. But for now, we'll just have to speculate and wait and see which rings have not been touched. And, uh, and paying attention to the symbols on the map, which I'm about to be showing you guys. So I know I keep saying about to be showing. But, like, let's actually talk of this for a second. Just, like, the few seconds. So we're going to have those as shown in the trailer. And this right here, which I thought was actually pretty cool. And it's going to have the rims. And, you know, the entire Halo ring. And also, you know, like, the... I guess the landscape, too. If you guys did not see the trailer, you know, it was... It was pretty much like that. Going to be kind of like that. So I wouldn't be surprised if it was kind of like the old ring. So now this is the new Halo trailer. Do not trust you. And this is the uh, foreshadowing part, I guess. There's Halo Lock and there's Arbiter, the new Arbiter saying, I'm hunting. But what happens is in this part, it actually shows the Halo Ring getting destroyed. So technically, the Halo Ring didn't get destroyed, but in the trailer, it shows a whole Halo Ring. So it makes it, makes it unlikely that we're going to be playing on installation a 04. Now there could be a new 04 uh, that we just don't know about because technically the installation 00 blew up in the end of Halo 3 along with the new installation. If you guys don't remember, they fired the new ring and it, uh, you know, blew back, blew up the arc as well onto it. So, uh, you know. <clears throat> Anything could really happen, I guess, yeah, even if Sentinels, let's bring them back into the equation. They're kind of crazy. They could build a new installation. It would take a very long time, but there's just so many of them that it could be true. So, and they pretty much make themselves. So, they're like an, they have, they're like an infinite source of just like little bugs in the universe. So, now going on to the ring, which I have to say in just like seconds is it did get blown up and it get it did go into pieces but technically see yeah that so i mean it's in pieces but technically once it's done cooling it'll be together and that means that matter and life and you know meteors kind of like the earth things can start you know landing on the planet again and bringing you know, back the dirt and the water you know kind of like earth you know the the meteorites brought the water kind of thing. So, I mean, <clears throat> that's pretty much how the Halo Ring goes. I mean, just how it is. So, we could be playing on it, and it could be reforged, or, you know, the Sentinels could have fixed it, as crazy as that is. You know, they're capable of that. Or also a new, you know, installation, I guess. And by that, I mean, pretty much the halo 2 ring we could also be on that ring so that means that there's a new monitor there in charge of stuff and um, yeah, that's kind of cool they show reach and they show what the halo ring kind of looks like so that means that 343 is most likely going to go along with it which i will be showing you guys also uh we're moving on to the map now so let's actually just take a uh look at the map and uh yeah see that's pretty much it so it blew up and i mean so the ring is powered off but here let's take a look at this so now we have some peace and quiet at least i know for once the um you know the audio it's uh quiet so there won't be any interruptions but what happens was the ring was deactivated in the end of halo uh 2 and see look at those graphics those are like perfect like those are that's gonna look good especially in the next one so that's pretty much what they're going to have is this a ring that looks like this and this is a uh, 343's interpretation of one so now we're going to get to look at the map and i'm going to show it twice so there's that ring okay so that's spinning around there's the monitor johnson and then what happens is he opens the map and 
We're going to see exactly what installation we are on and which other installation. So here we go. So here's the map. And it kind of looks like there's five to be, you know, exact. Uh, it really, things kind of like interfere with each other as like the Halo lore kind of goes. But let's just say there's five. So that means installation three has been taken out. Installation, this installation right here that we're looking at. So installation literally <clears throat> is I guess it's not taken out it's just been deactivated so that means the ring can't work but it still can you know be played on and there can be you know enemies on it so I mean you really just have to look for the uh, you know lore in this and see what happens when 343 comes out with the new Halo Infinite and find out which exactly is the new ring but judging from this map we know where all the halo rings are and uh, which ones they are each of them has their own little different symbol so that's pretty cool so unless you're like a symbol person you can see that? and then see this you can pause it if you want but that is literally 343's in like the composer's not interpretation you don't actually see the ring that much they don't for? actually show it the off not gonna save but itself. that's how it looks now the last thing we're just going to see is what 343 has in mind for the ground play this is literally it um, just out of the bay window so it kind of looks like there's like some pieces that are water the clouds, they have mountains, they have like little areas on it that are kind of like metal, they have like metal veins, which I find pretty cool, and I'm kind of glad that they did this and just showed it off, so this is definitely what their Halo ring will look like, because it's their game, and this is their interpretation of it, but anyway guys, that is it for me, thanks for watching, please go check out my other Halo content on what like Halo Infinite, like what the gameplay will be like, I think it's like actually very accurate, and... Uh, please subscribe to my channel and turn on your notifications so if you are new here that you'll be able to notify when our next Halo video comes out and all that good stuff. Thank you guys for watching and hopefully I'll see you guys. Welcome to North Hill, a new townhome development located in the north end of Boise, Idaho. Offering two or three bedroom floor plans with refined finishes and natural stone throughout. Come check us out and visit us at NorthHillBoise.com.